Right. Hi there, guys. So I'm with you with something really exciting today. Now, then, as you may or may not know, we've been working on a restaurant system for quite some time. Now, to kick off with the restaurant system, we have a whole scan bit. So when people walk into the restaurant, they can scan their phone. And it means that you've got a track of your track and trace and stuff like this, right? Now, we also have another part of it, which is pretty damn cool. Um, we're actually putting the graphics together right now uh, for restaurant owners to put into their restaurants to explain that they can start their customers, sorry, that the customers can actually start ordering food, um, drinks and everything else from the tables. Now, in the UK at the moment, we're having another big lockdown on coming. So this is coming at the right time for the UK. Now, I want to take you over a couple of things that we've got. Now, this is just, imagine this is on your regular restaurant uh, website and you're going to be able to see menu and order or table reservations, right? All cool so far. Now let's actually listen through about what COVID's all about and how it's actually managed to um, do an awful lot of problems to everybody. Now, what I had before was I was actually running a takeaway system through the um, through my chatbot itself. And my thought was there's a better way of doing that because on the chatbot, what we had to do was ha provide the, the name and email address on every single order. So what I thought I would do is actually run it through and do a different kind of takeaway. Now this takeaway can be used in store as well as as a takeaway system. Um, it can be used for curbside drop, it can be used for pre-booking um, the meals and whatnot, it can be used for booking a table, it can be used for anything. Right, so the full system comprises of, right? Hold on to your take because there is quite a lot. So first off you've got the chat and trace. Right, next you have the menu and food order. So once they do the chat and trace, they'll be asked to go to their table and once they go to the table, then they can have a look at the menu, um, have a look at the drinks orders, and they're gonna get it all through their mobile phone. So it means that they're not gonna to have to keep on having the bits of paper or waiting for the waitress to come over and all the rest of it. Um, I drink far too much myself in pubs. And waiting for the waitress can be a bit of a nightmare because, well, they're busy. And there's an awful lot of people about. So next, you've got the built-in takeaway food ordering. So if the worst does happen and we do come under lockdown again, you have a complete takeaway food ordering system which all goes in. I'm gonna show you the back end of that as well at the end of this video. Um, I'll put a little back end thing that I've recorded because what you can actually do is send it to your manager's phone um, or you can send it via email or you can just print it out on your POS system. Right, now then, orders are obviously sent in the kitchen, um, so that's all cool. And then what else we're doing is we're actually doing an SMS marketing service. Now this SMS marketing service is something awesome. Now there's two ways that we can do this. One is where we completely look after the thing um, and basically we take the restaurant owner's number um, and we will set up all the marketing for them if they just tell us how they give them what to do the marketing and after that we will do everything. There's no need for them to worry about another thing. Now, there's another way of doing it. The other way of doing it is actually giving the restaurant owner um, the way to do it on his mobile phone. Now this way isn't quite as good because you're not gonna have quite as much control as what we have. Um, however, it is still doable. If you like to do the marketing yourself, that's all cool, it's not a problem. Right, so that's gonna fill up your quiet nights because if you have a quiet night, send out a little promotion, um, get them onto takeaway, and as soon as they're at the takeaway, it is flying. You can also make coupons up and give them discounts whenever you want to. Um, you can do absolutely everything. Also, track the deliveries and stuff like this. Right, so, Client can run the SMS campaign, so that's when the manager has the actual phone. Um, and you're gonna get reviews on autopilot. Now, what that means is, after somebody comes into your restaurant, bar, takeaway, whatever, and they scan in, 23 hours from that, they're gonna get a little text message that says, how did you enjoy your meal? Was it all good for you? Now, if it was good for them, awesome. Um, you can actually set what, how many stars they're gonna post before they get to put the stars on either Yelp, Facebook, Google, wherever you want them to go. Um, so we'll send them directly to, straight off to that review platform. Right, so that's another thing. So the reviews are gonna be flying, um, your website is gonna be optimized, and you're gonna get an awful lot more business. Right, so let's have a look what it all looks like. I'm sorry, there is an awful lot to go through, so you'll have to forgive us, right? So on entry, then basically they come in, and they can either place the phone onto a little pad, but I would strongly suggest that you use the little scan me thing, right? Which all you do, you open up your camera in your phone, square comes up, it pops up, it says, would you like to open up Messenger? You click yes, and that's them in. Um, from there, it asks them for the telephone number 
and the telephone number, we can then start the marketing side of things. Right, so we're not only doing track and trace like the government wants us to, but we're also growing our email list because at the end of the day, the money's in the list. Now next, you arrive at the table, and once you arrive at the table, it'll take a little order for you, and you can do all the ordering. So it's all cool. Um, again, just a simple push button thing, and you're straight in. Now I'm actually gonna give you an app as well. Now if you want to use an app, that's completely up to you. Some people like the app, other people don't want another app because they've heard too much about apps and they're sick of it. Um, but you can have an app if you like an app, and jobs sorted on that one. Now next, your order is sent off to the kitchen. So the kitchen's gonna receive your order, they're gonna have a look through your order, gonna prepare it, and they're gonna send it out. Right, you've also got the SMS marketing. So this number here. So what they can do is while they're sitting, they can then opt in to your SMS marketing. And what this means, is it means that you've got people who are actually asking to be marketed to. So you're not just marketing willy-nilly left, right, and center. Um, you're gonna have loads of points of contact. You're gonna first have Facebook Messenger, which you can message them on. And I'm gonna show you how we're gonna do the menu in Facebook Messenger as well, as well as on the website. Um, you're also gonna have SMS texting, which is huge. And if you know anything about marketing, then what happens is, email marketing has kind of, it's went downhill an awful lot lately. And because email marketing's went downhill so much, <clears throat> everybody's kind of, they've got too used to emails. Um, tend to flick through the emails and just fly through them all. We're in a scroll kind of situation right now. And that's what's sadly happening. So text messaging, people still pull out their phones and have a look at the text message. Facebook messaging is still pull out Facebook and have a look at what messages they've got. So then, next thing, we're gonna do complete training. Um, so we're gonna include how to install different parts of the system, how it works and everything else, right? So you're gonna get complete training. But what does the system look like, right? So again, imagine this is on your web page, right? Um, well, first off, we'll do a table reservation. So we're gonna click on table reservation. And now remember, I haven't got a restaurant link to this. So obviously, I have to appreciate that my restaurant's not open. Right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take um, the date and time. So a number of people, I'm gonna say 12 people. We can set this for a maximum amount of people that you would like to come into your restaurant at a time. Um, you might only want eight or something like this. But also as well with pubs and restaurants having to book um, tables out now for people to come in, this is gonna save you an absolute load of time. Right, so the date, we're gonna fill out the date. We're gonna fill out the time. And we're gonna fill out the comments, if there's any comments that needs to be done, right? So table is kept 15 minutes after reservation time. We appreciate you being on time, right? So basically just giving them a little hunt, little um, thing there saying, come on, you've got to come down in time, lads and lasses. Um, come get your drinks. Can't wait to have you here, but we're only gonna hold it for 15 minutes. So that's gonna, first off, start speeding up your table. Now then, another bit, and I'll just refresh that because um, I've got too much open. Right, another part that we're coming on. Once it loads up again, is C menu and order. Now then, the C menu and order. You have to forgive my page. My page has got a lot of other bits. Right, so first off, again, we've got this opening hours. Don't worry about it. Um, obviously, mine's not linked to a restaurant as such, so I don't want to take orders. Right, so first off, you can go and see the opening hours. You can see a load of details on that. And what I've decided to do was put a little 10% with your first order. Awesome. So it means that a lot more people are going to order um, when they're locked down. So you're going to send this out. You're gonna have it on your restaurant tables, a um, little flyer. Um, we have the flyers ready for you as well. Um, we're gonna have the flyers ready for them. We're gonna have them opting in via SMS. We're gonna have them clicking and opting in via chatbots. We're gonna have them going through the menu. We're gonna have everything all in place. It's perfect. Right, and what's gonna happen is they're gonna come in, they're gonna see 10% off the next order when they order for delivery, and they're gonna order it. Now, we then have all of the different products. So all the different products we've got, this is a very, very basic menu because um, it's actually taken a friend of mine's restaurant um, and bar, and she's obviously cut down on the amount of food that's going out there due to COVID. So we have crispy garlic chicken, chicken rings, and we can order all of these straight away. We can see if we want any extras on them. So maybe you've got a steak on there, maybe you only want um, a little bit of your steak, maybe you want it rare, well done, whatever. Um, however many you want, so that's all cool in there. I'm gonna pick our main meals. Um, now it does work better with pictures as well. Uh, just let you know, pictures are awesome. They work very, very well. So we like pictures a lot. Um, then we've got the information on the actual place. So we've got delivery fees, if you have any delivery fees. 
you've got um, delivery, same as opening hours, pick up, same as opening hours. So they can actually order this on their way home. Bear that in mind, right? There's a bit coming about that. Um, languages, payment methods, cards, cash, phone number, and everything else. That is actually my phone number. Um, so <clears throat> what you can then, oh yes, sorry, you can also make a call. Um, obviously I'm on a computer at the minute, so I'm not doing that. Right, <clears throat> so let's have a look where we're at, where we're at. Right, so that's that's that lot done. All right, now then, as I said before, you can do a pickup. Now, the biggest bonus about a pickup is, I guarantee your restaurant, pub, takeaway, whatever, is close to a major road. Um, nine times out of 10, quite major roads being set up. And so people pass your takeaway, restaurant, whatever. Now then, all you need to do with the SMS marketing is text people. If they were gonna finish work at half past five, if you send them a little text saying, hi, um, I know you're gonna be coming home after a hard day at work. If you're passing us, why not have your meal ready for us and we'll give it to, it to you. So they can then, as they're passing, stop off, grab their meal. You can either take cash for it, you can take card for it, you can do whatever you want with it. Um, and it's gonna fill up your restaurant left, right and center. Because I know if I get a text on my way home tonight, from a takeaway, I'm gonna end up stopping at that takeaway and go and picking something up. Um, as human nature, we're all born lazy, it's terrible. I, I, I'll admit it first, I'm, I'm a not very good person at them cooking. Right, so that's another huge bonus that the SMS is gonna give you. Now, SMS as well has no limits, right? Now then, you do get charged for SMS messages. Um, however, unless you've got a huge list, the SMS thing, you're gonna be lucky if you cover five, five pound a week. Um, five dollars a week it's just it's next to nothing and you can send out a lot of text messages now I would suggest on your promotion messages uh, what I would do is I would actually segregate them into lists which we can do with our SMS software so that's not a problem we can put them in lists for people who's finishing work at certain times so if they're finishing work as you run um, open up your shop whatever then that's when you can text all those people or if you want a particular promotion so if so you've got a quiet night or something like this you can send out a big text on your quiet night or the night before your quiet night. Ask people if they want to come down, offer a little bit of a discount. Your place could be chock a block, all right? So that's the SMS side of it and the ordering side of it. But Facebook is huge, right? Everybody knows about Facebook. Everybody needs Facebook. Everybody uses Facebook. Everybody's got Facebook. It is torture, right? So we need something for Facebook. Now, there's a couple of different things about Facebook that you may or may not know. Firstly, if you are if you have a Facebook page such as this, and um, this is just our little page, we've only just made it up, so don't worry about it. Um, if you've got a page such as this, the easiest way to get engagement is to do lives, all right? Now then, what you need on that page is you need some good, um, some good images, you need some lives on there. You want to be really engaged with your clients. Now, the more you engage with the clients, the more Facebook will show your page off different people. And what you need to be getting is you need to be getting people to like or love your post. So if you just put up a normal post, then around about 10% of all of your followers will see it. This is why don't ever just add people will nearly your page because otherwise you're wasting some of those views. Now then if you're doing a live, Facebook will increase that to around 15 to 20% of people will see your lives. If people start engaging with the lives, such as writing in, such as clicking, um, writing a message, anything like this, what's gonna happen then is Facebook's gonna start showing to some of their friends because then Facebook says, right, okay, well, this is get engagement, let's show it to more people. And it's gonna start showing to other people. Now then, while you're on Facebook, the perfect place is to sell to people where they're actually at. So what we've done here, you'll have to excuse, I'll have to press test button because this is my page. So we'll press test the button. And what happens is we come straight back we don't because I've got too much open. We would come straight back and we would actually get the whole thing. However, my Facebook is extracting the rank, so we're going that slowly. Right, let's close that. Right, so what you get is you get the Feud Guru demo. So you get exactly the same menu, you get exactly the same everything, all within your Facebook. So people can actually order within their Facebook. They don't even have to step away from the computer. So, that's how far so far. Now then, there's also a few other things that we're undoing. Now then, what you need is, you need various different things that's gonna pull people in, because you need Facebook posts. So, 
what we have here is we have promotional video templates. We have um, different business cards, flyers, menu, mini menus, all the rest of it. We're actually selling these separately as well if you want them. And um, promotion video are just something simple, such as this, um, which will just play if my computer didn't have all 50,000 things all going at the same time. So as you can see, nothing flash. However, what it does do, it draws people to your Facebook page. Um, it's also very easy to rank this as number one in, you, in YouTube and things like this to get your restaurant more known. Now, these we give you menus, we give you all sorts of things as well. Um, we give you the different things to put on the tables, the trifolds, the menus, the whole lot. So basically, as soon as you start, then you are flying with all of this system. Now, that I know this sounds like an awful lot to take in, right? And I know it is an awful lot to take in. However, if you want a hand, if you want a boot call, anything like that, then if you would like to go to Food Guru, so it's foodgurumarketing.xyz, all right? And just book an obligation consultation, dead easy, right? Um, give us a shout, walk you through it. If the system's right for you, it will work an absolute dream. If the system isn't right for you, then it won't be, it won't work a dream. Um, but don't worry, I'll tell you, um, we're not in the, we're not in the business to actually rip people off. We're here to help. Um, at the minute, with this COVID thing coming down, I used to actually be in the pub trade myself a long time ago. I'm showing my age now. I used to be in the pub trade myself. And I must admit, this is why I built all this. Because right now I'm sick of seeing pubs struggling, pubs closing, pubs still getting charged rent and rates and all this. Not rates, actually, but rent. Um, still have to pay the insurance. Still have to pay all of this little lot. The staff price are all increasing. Everything's all increasing. This is a way of cutting all of that down and actually make it so if we do have another lockdown or if these COVID things keep on coming into place, even when they don't, then you're prepared to not only survive but to thrive. Now remember, imperfect action will beat perfect inaction every time. So if you would like to um, see more about this, that's foodgurumarketing.xyz. Um, anybody who's interested in actually getting this, anybody who's, who knows anybody with a restaurant, Please tag them in this. Um, pubs and restaurants can really be helped with this. Anyway, that's all I've got for today. Um, there's more than enough here because you're probably sick of hearing my voice. I'll show you what the back end looks like right now. Um, and just get a little silent video with it moving about. And you can see what you think. Right, cheers. Have a good day. Thanks very much. Bye.